One of life's greatest yet easiest pleasures is venturing into the great outdoors with your backpack full and your tent set up. It may be the prospect of being fully self-sufficient for a few days, or simply a desire for some peaceful time in nature. Whatever the case may be, keep these five pointers in mind before embarking on your first camping trip. One, be ready at all times. Camping trips, like any other vacation, necessitate some preparation. Draw up a list of all you think you'll need once you've agreed on the dates and venue, and call the head to make sure a place is open at the time you've chosen, which may be affected by your choice of location. If you've made your list, you'll be able to quickly distinguish between the must-haves and the good-to-haves, which will make packing much easier. Before you go, look up a weather forecast and get some ideas about what to wear. Make a menu for all of the meals you'll need when you're gone, and you'll know which ingredients you'll need and where to keep them, in a cooler box, for example, or somewhere safe from being squashed. You get the idea. Always have a backup plan. While you will hope to spend every day outside soaking up the sun, make sure you have rainy day activities planned as well. 2. Learn the ropes. Find some time in the garden or a nearby field to practice setting up your tent before your first camping trip. This might seem excessive, but thoroughly testing your equipment in controlled environments, particularly if it's new, and getting a clear picture of what goes where is a good idea. You'll easily learn the ins and outs of your gear by setting up camp at home, noticing its quirks and shortcomings, as well as any weaknesses. Instead of navigating a whole new world and all that comes with the unknown, discover that you need a specific method, strategy, or help, such as a torch, while still on familiar ground. Even if this isn't your first ride, it's still a good idea to check your gear to make sure it's in good working order, particularly if it's been sitting in storage for a while. 3. Take precautions. Make sure you keep all of your belongings together when you arrive at your campsite. Make a designated area for all of your pegs, sacks, supplies, and tongs when erecting your tent. It might seem self-evident, but many people overlook it. If you've made a habit of knowing where your belongings are, you'll be able to locate them quickly after dark or in an emergency. Take good care of your tent. It most likely cost you a lot of money, and it is, after all, your home away from home. Take the following measures to protect both the interior and exterior of your home. Spread out ground sheets, for example, when faced with strong winds and heavy rain, stop cooking or brains too close to the tent, and batten down the hatches, flaps, and awnings. Taking care of your gear and teaching your children to do the same would result in healthier and more relaxed camping experiences in the future. 4. Make time for yourself. If you're a seasoned camper or not, having extra tent fabric and a tent repair kit on hand is a must. You never know how, why, or when an inconvenient misfortune could happen, so it's always safer to be safe than sorry by packing a few extra tent pegs, an extra roll of duct tape, and, of course, an emergency repair kit. Consider bringing a spare sleeping bag and a few extra pieces of clothes, depending on the room available in your car. If your primary set gets wet or broken, you won't want to be without these two necessities. 5. Get up close and personal, but not too much. When selecting a camping spot, you can be drawn to public amenities such as the ablution block or the pool area. If you want to socialize, you've probably chosen a good spot. However, if you want peace and quiet, setting up camp near the communal pool, bry field, ablution blocks, or playground is not the best choice. While the convenience can appeal to you, keep in mind the other campers in the area, including those who have yet to arrive. In these places, early mornings and late evenings carry more activity, chatting, and noise in general, so if you're looking for some peace and quiet, look for a location that's safe from both the weather and people. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel.
Thanaks for watching.